Hi everyone, I'm Nikki from Homemadeville.com and today I am hosting another Crafty Hangout for CraftyHangouts.com and our sponsor this month is American Crafts and they sent us an amazing box of all kinds of paper goods and um, they were patriotic themed and the ones that I got had kind of a glitter inspiration to them so I want to show you first of all what I got and then we'll talk about um, the hair accessories that we're going to make with those things today so one of the things that they sent were these papers so there's a whole collection of glittery papers I actually kind of like the way the lights uh, shining on these little papers as you can see here um, so they were all different colors and they have kind of this texture to them so that was really neat I like those and then there were some other just Plain, more plain papers that didn't have the glitter on them as well in some of the patriotic colors and neutrals. Um, another thing that they sent were these little um, toothpick flags. Um, they're really neat. They've got the kind of red, white, and blue and some other colors in them as well. And then they sent these stickers that have like 4th of July and all kinds of things on them. They're flags as well, little pendant flags. And then a pack of glitters in shades of blue and white. And then they sent these red brads here, um, which have the glitter on them as well. We'll look at those a little bit closer later. And then they sent this glitter tape, which I absolutely love. And we're going to talk a little bit more about that. So I got red, white, and blue in different widths. Um, and they are glittery too. Hopefully you can see that. And then they also sent a little pack of stickers so they have all kinds of USA and stuff like that on those so today I want to show you um, how to make patriotic hair accessories I bought a little patriotic outfit for my daughter and so now she's gonna have a perfect little accessory um, for her hair that will match the outfit so this is one of the hair bows that I made um, here it says America on it and it's got the glitter and that's the one I'm going to show you how to make today and then this one you make kind of similarly but it's just a different style of hair bow so um, there's that one with the stars on it and let's go ahead and get started on making our accessories so I started out with just a plain bow this actually is left I think from when I was a teenager always had the little ponytail in the big bow and you know they used to have the big huge bows on them um, so that's what this was I had ripped the bow off over the years knew I would never wear that bow again but I kept this and I'm so glad I did because here's what I did I started out with the ribbon now on the one that I showed you I used the blue ribbon and for the one we're going to do today I am using the white glitter ribbon so let me pull that up a little bit let you see that so I've already gone ahead and cut out the little white ribbon and for whatever reason it has disappeared so I guess I'm going to show you how to cut it out so I started out by taking the ribbon here or excuse me it's not ribbon it looks like ribbon it is a it is glitter tape and so it feels firm and looks like a ribbon but then when you peel this off it's just like tape and it goes on so smoothly and wraps around really easily it's just perfect for a project like this So I'm gonna go ahead and start by cutting it to size so I'm gonna do a rough cut to start with then I'm gonna go in and cut it the actual width I need because this one's a little bigger the other one was actually the perfect width for what I needed um, but I wanted to try the white one too so now I'm going to go in very carefully kind of cut this in the width that it should be for the hair bow so as you can see I've cut that you can even trim down the edges because the edge of the hair bow is kind of rounded I'll show you from the back you can see how it hangs over so it's kind of rounded so I'm going to go ahead and make my ribbon rounded out a little bit as well and I'm sure you could probably wrap this tape around because like I said it's really flexible and so easy to work with but I'm going to go ahead and do it myself just to make sure that it's not showing or flipping up later 
Okay, so I kind of cut the edge of that, and now I'm going to take and just peel the back of it off. So you can see it just peels right off. And I'm going to stick this onto my hair bow. So just fits right on. It gets a really good stick. I just love the way it just sticks right on. I mean, see, hanging off, it's all there immediately. Um, there's the closer view. I'm hoping you can see the glitter on this because I really like it, but the white is a little bit harder to see. Now the next thing I did was take the little glittery brads that they gave us. So here's kind of a close-up of what the brads look like, and I hope you can see that. Um, and I just started by sticking them in. Because my bow had the little holes on each side, that made it really easy for me to give it just an extra little um, layer with these brads. So I just stick it in and then open it up. So there we've got one on. And I'm going to go ahead and do the second one. And I just push it through to make that hole in there. Well, it's already got the hole, but to make the hole in the, the glitter uh, the glitter tape. And then once I get it in, which I'm having difficulty on this one. Okay. Once I get it in, then I open that up as well and just fold it around. So now you can see. If I had a little bit of excess like I did on the other hair bow with the brad, then I would just take it and trim it with wire cutters. So it's real simple to do. The next thing I did was I took my circle cutter and I cut the glitter paper into the size circle that I needed for the sticker that I'm going to use. So I went ahead and cut my sticker, I mean my uh, paper, my craft paper, and now I'm going to go ahead and peel one of the stickers off. I'm going to use the little white star up here. And so I'm going to peel that off. Now I have a white star. I'm going to stick that right onto my glitter paper, get it kind of centered in there. And there's that. And now I'm just going to take a hot glue gun, put a little bit on the back of the sticker or the uh, circle paper. You can also do it by sticking it directly, putting the glue directly on the hair bow as well. That's another option. So then I'm just going to stick it kind of in the middle. And I can tell I got some glue here. Okay, get the strings off of the glue. And there we have it. So quickly, from start to finish, I was able to make what I think is a pretty cute little hair bow. And it'll be perfect with a ponytail or um, low ponytail or whatever you want to do to go with your patriotic outfit for upcoming Fourth of July or any other of the patriotic holidays. So that's what we did. Super simple. I love the way the glitter tape worked. It was so easy, so, so easy to use. I just really like it. As a matter of fact, I think it would be cool. I do a lot of bulletin boards at my daughter's school, so I think it would be kind of cool to use the glitter tape to put things on the bulletin board so you don't even have to staple or hide staples or anything like that. You can just tape it right up on the bulletin board and you got cute little glitter tape to go on it, so I think that might be fun to do with it too. But that can be another crafty hangout. We'll do a bulletin board maybe sometime. Anyway, thanks so much for coming and stopping by, and thank you to American Crafts for giving us some amazing product to work with. I really had a great time working with it, and I'm excited to see what we do in the future on craftyhangouts.com. And I hope you'll stop by and visit my blog, which is homemadeville. Dot com, and there you can find all kinds of homemade inspiration, whether you're looking for recipes or do-it-yourself things at home or just crafts and gift ideas. There's plenty of stuff there, so I hope you'll stop by, and I hope you have a wonderful week. Thanks so much. Bye-bye.